one and all, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, all the different people of Earth and beyond, friends, family, allies, and animals, to the mysterious world under our feet of Beth the Bunny and her fabulous friends. Welcome to the transmissions of Rabbit Ears. Welcome to Rabbit Ears. As always, I am your host, Beth the Bunny, and with me are Magic and... He's missing again! Magic, he's missing again! He is. I, I, don't, I don't know where Mr. Blaze is. Oh my goodness, when I was late, it was because I had a very important story last week. I wonder where he is. Yeah, me too. I wonder. I hope he's okay. Hey guys, guys, I'm here. Yay! Chill out. I'm a lot. And because you are my best friends in the whole world, I have brought a plate full of hot dogs for my friends and me to have a crazy hot dog party. Oh, Mr. Blaze. What? Blaze, I'm, I'm a bunny. I'm a, I'm a vegetarian. I can't eat a hot dog. Uh, really? I'm not allowed to. It won't be good in my tummy. Oh, really? Nope. What about you, Magic? Do you eat hot dogs? I appreciate that you made the hot dogs and that you wanted to have a party, but yeah, I'm so sorry. I, I, I don't eat meat either. Oh, you don't eat meat? No. How come you don't eat meat? I just... I'm not sure it's kind to animals to eat them. Oh, because it's made out of animals? Yeah. Oh, okay. If, would it make you feel bad if I ate hot dogs? You're allowed to eat hot dogs. We just personally choose not to. Oh, is that that's okay? Yeah. For people to be different like that? Yeah, for people to have a different take on it. Because I, yeah, I think, yeah. I really massively appreciate the gesture. It's so you nice You wanted to share ways. with us. Okay, well, maybe tonight I can go to the grocery store and I can, I can make hot dogs, but instead of the wieners in the buns, they could be carrots in the buns. <gasps> Yummy! That's, that's my favorite! A hot carrot! <laughs> hot carrot. Oh, what do we got to watch first here today? First up, we have Inanimated Object, Helpful Animals. Then after that, we've got Max and Gus's Art Challenge. Oh, Max and Gus. Yay, Max we get a Max and, and Gus. Gus day. That's my favorite kind of day. Oh, hot dog time for me. And, I'm, and I appreciate you guys uh, letting me still continue my hot dog. Uh, lifestyle. Let's check it out guys. Oh, hi there. What's your Hello. name? Hi, I'm Clarice. My Who name is Naomi. It's good to meet you. Good to meet you too. What are you doing over here? I was just going over to see my pet horse. Really? I'm helping oh. get my aunt out of the water the other day. Your aunt? What's your aunt's name? Her name is Penelope. Penelope, I like that name. Mm -hmm. I have a cat named Penelope. But it was incredible. She pulled her out of the water from her hair. Ooh, did that hurt or did she like it? I think she really liked it. Do you like your horse a lot? No. <laughs> Why not? She could get into trouble sometimes. She can? Is that the only thing she can do? She bites people. She bites people, that's just how, wow. When I try to feed her, she doesn't like to be nice. And she, she tries to bite my finger off. I thought she was nice though, she was helping that lady, or the aunt. Well, she's nice to other people, she just doesn't appreciate me. Ah, uh, wow, how the tables have turned. What about you? What is your favorite animal? My favorite animal? I have a lot of favorite animals. They're all so nice and helpful. Did you know? I saw this bird once. She was helping the worm out of the ground. She put him right out of the ground with her mouth. She was helping him out because he got stuck. The poor worm. So she helped him out. That bird was very How did the worm get underground? I, I don't know. normally imagine worms going underground. Neither do I, but she helped him out, and then she gave him to her baby. 
so she helped them out and now the worm is babysitting the babies see you later <laughs> oh well i gotta go too i have to go visit my bicycle down in hopper town my bicycle got broken i need to go visit my plant in my fireplace oh how cozy that sounds very nice well bye bye have a nice day <laughs> you too My name is Max, I'm 11, and... Uh, hello, I'm Gus, I'm 10 years old, and my favorite color is waffles. Time starts now. Each participant has been There's given a secret a phrase that they need pizza. to draw. The this challenge is for the other either. kid to figure um, out the phrase just from looking at the picture. <laughs> they only have two oh, minutes nice. to draw. I like that. With steaks on it. This looks like a pepperoni. It's made with, 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 it's horrible. Uh, my specialty is breathing. That's why you like Max. Ha, ha. Ouch. Um, it's just, I don't really know. You kind of just draw. No, I forgot that. I don't know, I need to draw those real quick. Uh, uh. This looks like a lot of lines. He doesn't even have a neck. Time is up. Time is up. Time is up. Why do you write I like? Is it serpents riding a bike? Yeah. He put PS, I like lards. Well, it's one thing about myself, so I gotta put it in. Huh? So Prince riding a bicycle. Is it monkey wearing a suit? Is it a, a lion in, in a suit? Where do you wear suits? At businessmen meetings? Um, is it lying that's a businessman? Yeah, he got it, yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> no! It's a lion that has an office job. How is this standing up? Decision, Max. Decision, Gus. Decision, Max. Decision, Gus. All right, guys, we're back. Okay, um, Miss, uh, sorry, Magic, my dear friend Magic, is going to serenade us with a beautiful song that I think you used to sing when you were little, didn't you? Yeah. You really liked singing this. So, take it away, Miss Ali. I'll just get you started. I went to the animal fair. The birds and the beasts were there. The big bubble by the light of the moon was combing his open hair. The monkey fell out of his bunk and slid down the elephant's trunk. Whee! The elephant sneezed and fell on his knees. And what became of the monkey? Monkey, 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 monkey. Down the elephant's trunk. We the elephant sees them fell on his knees. And what became of the monkey, 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 monkey,
Dabbidi doopy scoobidi doopy 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 doo Doop the monkey monkey monk <laughs> Well that's why I told you to sing it because I didn't know it. Well that was very interesting that and beautiful. That was very good magic. Yeah you did really good thank you. That sounds like a fun song. Where did you learn that song? Um, I'm not sure. You don't know? Did you sing it when you were little? Yeah. I sang it when I was little. I'm not sure where I learned it from. Cool. What do we got next? What's on the next? What's on the... Next up, we've got The Adventures of Sydney and Truffles, episode number six. Lovely. I can't wait. Let's check it out. Episode 6. Hey you! Are you the Grobbin? <laughs> Excuse me. I've had a bit of a cold ever since I've been down here. What I mean is, yes, but only my daughter ever calls me the Grobbin. It's a nickname she called me since she was a baby. But hardly anyone else knows that. Hmm. We have been sent here by the king of your world to do whatever we can to take care of you and stop you from destroying the planet. That is interesting. Why? Because I am the king and I certainly don't want to destroy the planet. I would very much just like to get out of this cavern and go home. I was transported here while I was sleeping about a week ago and haven't been able to find my way out since. Princess Pies told us that you would try to trick us by saying crazy things! Nothing crazy about what I'm saying. It's all true. I'm not much of a crazy guy. Sydney, maybe we should consider something. Like what? First, I had a weird feeling when we got that message from the princess. Second, she didn't want us to bring Gore with us. And third, this guy seems harmless. So, uh, what are you trying to say? I think this guy might be the king. And, and she said she didn't want Gore to come because he would recognize him. Now you're getting it. And, and, and they got people from another planet to do the dirty work because everyone here would know that what the king looks like. Bingo. Uh, just one thing. Yeah? Why would his own daughter want to get rid of him? Hmm, good question. Let's find out. All right, listen up. Uh, excuse me, but what are you two talking about over there? Your Majesty? Yes? We're, uh, we're gonna take you home. Fine by me, let's get out of here. I haven't sat on the royal throne in a week. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Gore, three to beam up. Ah, uh, we are back from Sydney and Truffles. Those guys, Adventure Time, basically, is what I'm trying to say about those guys. Excellent times. Say adventure so, every time. Um. I'm just gonna let you sing it. Sure. Okay. <laughs> She's hungry. That's messed up. She hungers. <laughs> 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 